The Center for Truth and Justice has strongly condemned the recent local government election in River State, describing the process as a travesty of democracy and an assault on the rule of law. The group also slammed Governor Simina Lai Fumbara for wasting taxpayers' resources on an exercise which they deem a bland disregard for democratic principles and the consolidation of power. Executive Director Center for Truth and Justice Obina Francis says the election was marred by irregularities including a lack of transparency, accountability and legitimacy. Provided, and the venue for the election was the government house. So you can put two and two together to arrive at the answers. So if an election was conducted in the government house, I think invariably you definitely know that there will be no security and there was no elections. And because there was no election, that was why securities were not provided. If there were elections all over the state, security must have been provided. An election, but a selection that was done by Governor Fubara. And this is what the Center for Truth and Justice stands against. The CTJ further criticized Governor Fumbara's use of proxy parties to advance his political agenda in the illegitimate process. The election, which was conducted within the government house, is an embarrassment to the state and the nation as a whole. This process lacked transparency, accountability, and legitimacy. There were no observers, no genuine electoral oversight, and no opportunity for the people of River State to make their voices heard. Instead, it was a coronation, not an election. A process aimed at installing Governor Fubara's puppets in key positions of power across the state. The group for the call on relevant authorities, including National Assembly, Judiciary, and international communities to intervene and restore the rule of law in River State, while urging Nigerians to remain vigilant and defend democracy, emphasizing that actions of Governor Fumbara threatens the democratic process.